Hello everyone, this is Moshe, the electric Israeli, and I'm chilling here by the Tesla supercharger in St. Petersburg, Florida. Uh, here it is, I'm charging my car, and today I want to compare the upcoming Kona EV and the Tesla Model 3 base model. Uh, not the expensive model because the price will be comparable. We'll do a few comparisons, but before I do that, if you're new to my channel, welcome. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel to my channel so you don't miss out on any of my videos. I produce a video every single day. And uh, also, if you are uh, already a subscriber, thank you for your support. Thank you for watching. And please, please don't forget to um, support this channel by becoming a Patreon. Your support means a lot to me and it helps me keep running and improving this channel. So let's get right at it. Uh, so the uh, in the early of 2019 and what I believe will be late spring or even mid-year of 2019, the Tesla Model 3 base and the Tesla and the uh, Kona EV will be available in the United States. So uh, I want to I want to compare like four or five main parts and see what you think and maybe you can contribute as well and let me know. So first of all, the keyword is availability. So if all plans go accordingly, Tesla Model 3 will be available in all 50 state base, the base model, 220, 60 kilowatt will be available, uh, I would say late spring, maybe mid-year June, uh, and hopefully, and I, and I think it's going to be a huge hit, people will buy it like there's no tomorrow. The uh, Kona EV, <coughs> from what I know, from what I hear, is going to be available uh, on what we know as ZEV states, ZEV, Z-E-V, zero emission vehicles, states on the coast left coast and right coast and that's what they say it's going to be available for now now judging on the hyundai ionic uh which is quote unquote available in the united states they sold so few of them they just don't bring them they don't make them i don't know what it is they sell, they sold nothing nothing really nothing compared to any other electric car so huge advantage to tesla because it will be available in 50 states uh, and even if uh, uh, Hyundai is going to have it available in mass production, it will be available only in few states. When is it going to be available in 50 states? I don't know. Judging on the Ionic, you get my point. Second of all, price. Here, I think uh, Ionic, uh, the Hyundai is going to have a huge advantage. The base price for the Model 3 will be $35,000. But, 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 uh, uh, there will be the tax incentive are going to be reduced to half by the beginning of 2019 and when the model 3 base is going to be out it's going to be to reduce on by another half so it's be very little very little uh, uh federal tax incentive available for the teslas now there are a lot of static uh, incentives but they're available for all evs not just tesla so tesla doesn't get advantage on state the other cars do get on federal so the, the hyundai is going to have tremendous it's going to have uh, the full 75 for many years uh their base price is close to thirty-seven thousand. so even though the model 3 will a little bit almost two thousand dollars less the kona will have the full 75 and the model 3 will have i think 1800 or something like that so it will be a difference of few thousand dollars okay if that's what so important to you now range range is very interesting and i tell you a little bit a different point of view 220 for the model 3 258 for the um for the uh, kona so obviously advantage kona but let me tell you why it's not an advantage i'm not a tesla fan uh, please i'm i'm a fan of evs i tell you why uh, if your driving is mostly local Anything above 200 makes no difference. Listen, I drove 40,000 miles on my on my Nissan Leaf, which has 80 miles range, and it's fine. Believe me, it's fine. I made it everywhere. So uh, anything above 200 for local driving makes no difference. None. On long trip driving, you say, okay, 258 is almost 40 miles more. Advantage Kona. Not really. I tell you why. Because... The Tesla has something that nobody else has, and what it is I'm doing right now, supercharging. They have supercharging. The others don't. Supercharging network is all over the United States. The other charging, the CCS, are mainly on the coasts, on the two coasts. You go to the middle, you're going to have a challenge. It's less, abandoned, it's less available, and, you know, it, it could be a challenge. I just 
drove to Florida and I'm telling you the supercharging network is one of the most amazing invention now not only that Tesla superchargers are about 120 plus kilowatts give you a jolt of of electricity in the first 20 minutes a Kona can receive maybe 50 50 that's it uh, and uh, 50 um, 50, uh, 50 kilowatt uh, 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 electricity uh, translate to to more than more more than half it's less uh, than than the uh, the Tesla now you say what's the big deal it's a huge deal it's a huge deal you stop in the Tesla supercharger you get 150 miles in about 15 minutes and you can move on that's the difference it's a big difference so even though it has 38 more miles the Kona does uh, once you get on the road uh, you have less available chargers and less power in each charger and that's a big difference so think about that so we got the availability we got the price we got the range and the charging uh, even though the batteries are the same and the last thing I want to talk about it's uh, my opinion the best advantage for Kona and that's the hatch I love hatchbacks and hatchbacks give you flexibility more room you can pile on all the way to the roof you think oh Moshe what's the big deal it's a big deal it's a huge huge deal traveling uh, long trips and and schlepping stuff and people and cargo hatch always wins now the shape of the car how it looks like that's uh, individually it's up to you so to speak but I have to tell you that uh, anytime I will pick a hatch over a sedan all right these are my four uh, components maybe you have different four ones you may have whatever you want you let me know please do that let me know in the comments meanwhile don't forget to subscribe to my channel help me change the world one electric car at a time and don't forget to uh, support this channel please support this channel I need to support you can become a patron or you can shop at the awesome electric Israeli store all the description below see you tomorrow with another video